to my rideshare friends, um, I'll also leave a screenshot of this at the end of the video, but um, I'd like to hear from you what your, like your worst case uh, Uber or Lyft scenario is when driving. And I'm not talking about being attacked by a passenger or being harassed or whatever. I'm talking about just purely on trips, right? So my, one of my big peeves, and um, uh, I think there were a few people who started a, uh, like a 2K challenge, and I thought, you know what, last week, and I'm going to show this in the next video, from like the 2nd or 3rd of September right up to yesterday, I think it was um, Sunday the 9th, making a video on that week, um, I went all in. And that's not crazy hours, but I'm talking about 50 hours, right? And I drove Uber, full-on, Lyft, and privates. Now, on my privates uh, trips, um, the, uh, I, I didn't have too many private trips lined up that week, so I knew I'd, hit, I'd have to hit it heavy on Uber and XL, right? And then, sorry, heavy on Uber and Lyft. And my very last trip, right, I think, let me check at what time it was. It was at um, 5.06 p.m. Sunday, September the 9th, right? Uh, my last trip, I thought, you know what, I'm going to throw in an XL, you know, just, just to see what happens here. Yeah, I've got about another one hour to spare, and then I'm calling it a day. And um, bam, 17 minutes in a completely, completely direction, a different direction, right? You'll usually see me uh, Thousand Oaks, Westlake, Hidden Hills, Calabasas. That's where I have most of my private clients. Boom, it takes me all the way over to Camarillo. And I'm like, oh God, 17 minutes. I said, I hope this is a nice long one that takes me all the way through to LAX and maybe on XL will pay about 90 bucks, right? Not the case. So you drive 17 minutes, to get a four minute trip. And after all is said and done, right, I'm left with $5.91. That was my worst nightmare because I hate driving far distances for tiny rides, right? And once in a while, strangely enough, it happens to me on XL. It doesn't really happen on SUV or Lux because the starting point is pretty high, right? The base fare. But um, this to me is atrocious. This is my Uber nightmare is specifically on XL. I have to go long, long distances, drive to only get a short, short trip. So I'd love to hear it from you. Uh, what do you think? Right. Um, and, and guess what? I only drive, I drove 1.79 miles, right? Within Camarillo, if you can check the addresses there. Um, not cool. Now, once upon a time when I did start off with UberX and Lyft and then they did the pool and the lift line nightmare. Can't stand those two, right? So, so share your stories. Is it pool you hate? Is it lift line you hate? Is it similar scenarios like this you hate? Um, I, I wrote a sarcastic comment. Don't you love those short trips after driving 15 minutes or more to get the passenger, right? So that ended up being an amazing week. I, I should have just called it an end at five o'clock and said, or, or just shortly before five, and said, that's it. I've hit the 3K club. I've made over $3,000 in riding, and I'll break it down for you in my next video. Uh, let me not do this. But I took a chance, and I, I lost on this one. You don't make money. You put on miles, you spend a lot of time, and you're getting very little money. So that was my final trip, and then I knew after that, that was a sign for me to stop the week. I mean, I could have maybe gone from five to 8 p.m., but no, that was it. Uh, I called it a day. 